All right, I'm back. Uh, today's a nice, nice day, and um, I just got out of school, so I'm gonna start working on this. Um, so far, I got the dowel pins in. These ones actually did not fit over these, um, so I had to take a Dremel and um, Dremel out the inside a little bit to clear the head stud, and it fits. It's nice and snug, and then I test fitted it on the head too. So the dowel pins are good. And um, you're gonna have to, you're gonna need dowel pins for any engine build just to align the head gasket and make sure it's not like off center this way or off center that way. Cause there's a hole for the, for this and it's gonna be exactly aligned for where it's supposed to be. And um, you need two. For LSV Tech, you need them on the exhaust side. Yep, I got three in so far and I have um, 13 more to go, 16 total. So I'm just doing the exhaust side first and then I'm going to do the intake side. Here's a um, rocker arm shaft. You can see it, it's like that. This hole would face up and that's for this hole. And that's for this little pin here that goes in here. Kind of locks it into place. And um, this is a plug that was holding it. Or I just like that. And yeah, overall this tool works pretty good. Um, I mean, there's not going to be an easy way to install valve springs, really. It's just experience. But um, yeah, I'm not that experienced with valve springs. This is only like my second time doing this. And all the other times I used a different tool. But um, this is my first time using this tool. I'd say it's pretty good. Got the dowel pins, head gasket,
got my little oil squirter and what I've been doing is kind of putting oil over these so I don't put everything on dry get in the threads for the bolts basically just put it everywhere except for spark plug holes like these Thank <laughs> you. 